Hello, my name is Sean Fitzsimmons, and I'm the Director of Education here at Revelation Software. What I'd like to talk to you about today are context menus and using them within your Open Insight forms. My talking points today are what are context menus, when should I implement context menus, how do I create a context menu, and then once it's created, how do I attach it to the controls on my forms. Context menus are context-sensitive me context -sensitive menus that occur on the right click of a control on your Open Insight form. What normally occurs is on an Open Insight form, you have a static menu at the top of the form. That static menu deals with all the functionality of the form and the controls within the form. When you don't want to deal with the uh, functionality specific to a control, you can make a context-sensitive menu so that only those items that are specific to the processing of the, the data within a, within a control can be done with a right click. When should I implement context-sensitive menus? Context menus should not be implemented on every control within a form. There are certain defaults that you can, that you can build into the form, such as cut, copy, paste, that will display on the right click of, uh, of the mouse. But for specific controls, you want to look at that control and say, do I need a menu specific to this control? And if, if necessary, then you would implement the context-sensitive menu there. Now, how do I build a context menu? Open Insight provides a context menu builder, which is accessible through the user interface workspace. The user interface workspace, commonly referred to as the UI workspace, is accessible through the application manager. There's a button on the side toolbar, and at the same time, it's accessible off the tools menu. Once you're in the UI workspace, from the tools menu, select the design context menu option off of that menu. What will display is the, is the context menu builder. What you can then do is build menus specific to a form and a control. And you can hook up uh, quick events, you can run stored procedures, you can call events on other controls once that menu is activated. Now, once I have the menu built, what will occur is a record is written to the SysRepos menu context table. And a corresponding entry is made in the, in, the, in the repository for that menu. Now I have it built, how do I connect it to my controls on a form? That's truly the easy part. With one command, either on the got focus event of each of the controls or the create event of your window, what you can do is just call the function called context menu, passing in the name of the control, and the message create menu. What will then happen is when the end user right clicks, it'll go off and it will display what was created using the context menu builder. And th that's it for the first part of our first part of our session here. We'll have a hands-on session in part two, where I show you how to create a context menu using the context menu builder. Thank you.